Jaden was a man who loved to fish. He found a peaceful lake nestled within a quiet forest where he would spend his days. This was his retreat, his sanctuary, where he'd take his little wooden boat out onto the water to relax and enjoy his hobby. One beautiful, calm morning, Jaden was in his boat, casting his fishing line and basking in the tranquility of his surroundings. Suddenly, he noticed another boat in the distance. At first, it appeared to be drifting aimlessly, and slowly, it began heading towards him. Jaden wasn't worried initially. He thought the boat would change its direction soon enough, but it didn't. It kept getting closer and closer, and Jaden began to feel frustrated. They're going to turn away at any moment, he assured himself. But the boat continued on its path, as the boat got dangerously close. Jaden shouted out in desperation, Hey, you're going to hit my boat, be careful. But his shouting didn't change anything, and the boat kept approaching. Then crash. The other boat bumped into his boat. Fury surged within Jaden. His peace had been disrupted. His boat had been hit. He turned around and started yelling at the other boat to vent his anger out. But as he looked over to shout at the other person, he realized there was no one in the other boat. It must have broken free from its moorings and drifted across the lake. At this realization, Jaden chuckled. He recognized the silliness of his anger. He realized that whether he had gotten angry or not, it would not have changed what happened. The empty boat had no control over its direction. It wasn't a personal attack. It was just an event that had occurred. Sometimes in life, you might feel like Jaden, sitting in your boat, when another boat comes crashing into your peace. You may feel wronged, slighted, and your first instinct may be to react, to let your anger rise. Remember though, that a lot of the times, the things that upset you, they're just empty boats. They don't have any intent to harm you or disturb your peace. They're just drifting, carried by the waves of circumstance, much like we are. And here's the key part. Your anger, your frustration won't change what happened. The empty boat has already hit, but how you respond, how you choose to feel afterward, that's entirely up to you. Will you hold on to your anger or will you laugh and let it go? understanding that some things are simply out of your control. Just like Jaden, we can't control the empty boats in our lives. They will come, they will disrupt, but how much power they have over us, that's our choice to make. Remember this, the next time an empty boat drifts your way. If you enjoyed this story, please consider subscribing to VidGrowth and sharing your thoughts in the comments below. We'd love to hear your insights and any stories. Until next time, be positive and keep moving forward.